one of the biggest questions people don't ask and they should is what do you uh, ideally want for your love life? And that gives them a chance to talk about if it's a committed relationship, they can describe what that is for you. And you get a picture, you know, of if you're in alignment on what that is in this stage of life. Um, so, yeah, yeah. Okay. So you're not just sex, but just like in general, right? Like, are you expecting a wife who cooks? Are you expecting yeah. the man to take out the garbage? Are you expecting for both of us to work full time? You um, know, I think backtracking a little bit, um, oh, that okay. might be a second or third conversation, but in terms of, um, are they looking for a committed relationship or marriage or are they looking for companionship, friendship, um, you know, physical intimacy, just at least in the initial conversation, um, you know, are they separated? And, you know, they're, for my clients, I, I advise them to avoid anyone who's currently separated because they're still in the mix of it. And until a divorce is final, um, I feel that they're not available like my client is. My client's 100% available for someone and this other person still has time in their process, you know, to, to take to fully physically, emotionally separate from the other person.